Hello everyone, welcome back to another GFX comment tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to be recreating this Daily Deals UI. This UI was made by my friend at Tixlum on Twitter. Check out his work, but uh, yeah. So to start off, I'm going to pick this red color with our eyedropper tool. Make a new layer. Go into your rounded rectangle tool. Make sure it's on shape. The fill is red and the stroke is off. Put the corner size on 15. Then make your rounded rectangle. Gonna make it the same size as this. All right, and hit control. Actually, right click rasterize layer, then control J. Right click blending options, color overlay. Um, pick this 3D color. Make sure it's on normal. This is all the way up. And right click rasterize layer style. Control T. Move this down. Then just merge these. All right. As you can see, we've got this inner red part. So get your eyedropper tool. Select it. Like so, make a new layer, clipping mask it, actually you don't really need to clipping mask it because you're not going to go out of it, and just make a rounded rectangle in here, um, alright, then right click rasterize layer, then right click blending options, inner shadow, Um, okay, wait, I put it on the wrong thing. In our shadow, all right. Then right click, rasterize layer style. Just gonna scale this down a bit. Real quick. All right. Then, I am going to make a new layer. Pick this light red color. Go into your rounded rectangle tool. Create the shape. Then right click, well, rasterize layer. And just move it over to here. Um, Actually, I'm going to make this a bit bigger. I'm going to set it to 20. Then I'm going to make the shape. Yeah, okay, that's better. So I can just delete this one. Then right click, rasterize layer, control T, move it along to here. Then control J, doing this bottom one, control T, then right click, blending options, color overlay, pick the 3D part color, then merge these, then right click, blending options, stroke, make it white, turn the size down. Then right click, rasterize layer style. I'm gonna move this a bit. Then I'm going to add these hexagons, so just pick the color. Then make a new layer. Go on to your polygon tool. Make sure it has six corners. Okay. Control J, Control T. Just gonna make this hexagonal pattern by duplicating them. Control J, whoa. Control G, huh? What the heck? Okay, right click, duplicate layer. 
Control T. Um, I'm just going to right click, rasterize layer, need to delete some. All right, hey, this is kind of annoying. Right click, rasterize layer. Um, Ctrl T. Control J, Control T. Move this down. All right. If I just merge, merge. And Control J, Control T. Then just cut these off. Bottom. Now I'm going to make the text color white and pick a font. I'm going to use um, Moon Get, seeing as I think that's the same font. And I'm going to put the text. Why isn't it loading? Alright, item name. All right. Need this to All right. Now if I just move this. Okay. Now control J, control T. Move it along. Control J, control T. Move it along. Do this. Then control J, control T. All right. Please. Okay. Just group them and make a new layer behind this. Pick the lighter red color, go into my rounded rectangle tool, make a rounded rectangle. I'm going to, all right, then control J, right click, rasterize layer, right click, blending options, color overlay. Dark red color, then right click, rasterize layer style, control J, scale it down. Um, okay. All right, so we've got that. So right click, blending options, in a shadow. And just merge these, then control T, right click, warp, arc. Just going to arc this. Alright. Now I'm just going to make a new layer, make the color white. 
pick a different font seems to use a different font for this one. I think it might be something like this. So daily deals. Um it's not the same, but Yeah, I'm gonna change it. How about super comic? Okay, super comic looks okay. So right click, rasterize type, control T, right click, warp, arc. Just arc it, control J, scale this down. Then right click, blending options, um, drop shadow, just adjust the distance, okay, now right click, rasterize layer style, and just group all of these, and here, is our finished UI so um, yeah I'm pretty happy with how it turned out if um, you'd like to see more content like this subscribe to the channel and also follow at GFX comment on Twitter follow me at Soren Key but uh, yeah hope you enjoyed the video